welcome back programmers in the today's section we are gonna learn warp perspective it means we are gonna copy this card we are gonna crop this card and we are gonna change this card view into horizontal view so let's try you can use any image you want i'm gonna use this uno card in a png link is in the description but you are free to use any image you want so first we are gonna note out this four point because we are cropping this image first and to do that we are gonna use paint so this is my image cards.png so just move your cursor in the first point and you can see in this area you can find the x and y coordinate of that point in this area let's try you can see this is giving us the actual live x and y so we just need this point this point this point and this point so just copy this area and remember this is the first point and this is the last point now let's create an array and store that points create a variable pt1 equal to np dot float 32 and i just stored the all of the x and y coordinate in here this is my first this is my second this is my third and this is my last one fourth point of my card now let's define the width and the height of our new image when our image is complete to crop how much height and width we want in that image let's try i just used height and width equal to 300 and 400 you are free to use any height and width you want now that we created our point now let's define point 2 equal to again np dot float 32 and we same in here we are gonna pass all of these four point in here but in this time we are gonna add where to start and where to end you can can see first i pass the 0 and 0 because we are starting from 0 and then i pass the width and the height go to the height and width and then i pass the width and the height you can change this value to determine the what this value for now that we created our data now let's put this data and get perspective transform because you can see this image is not an actual horizontal this is kind of 3d image we want to convert this 3d into 2d so we are going to use get perspective transform so create a variable matrix equal to cv2 dot get perspective transform and then pass the src and dst destination which is point 0.1 and point 0.2 so pass the original image and pass the point 0.1 and point 0.2 which is our cropped image and then for last for warp perspective we are going to use warp perspective so create a variable cv2 dot warp perspective and pass the three argument first one is original image the second one is matrix and the third one is width and height now in here get perspective transform if we pass the image it is not gonna work so just pass the point one and the point two because it just create the 3d into 2d transform it just transform the image we want to transfer or this cropped image and this or width and height to fit this point 1 into point 2 and in the output war wars perspective just pass img matrix and width and height you can see i just pass img1 matrix and width and height in the warp perspective now let's just i am show the output i used width and height equal to 300 and 200 and you can see the actual image of our this cropped card so that's how you can change the dimension and the perspective of image using opencv so you can see this is the single card image of this uno cards image and you can see this is now actual horizontal image so that's how you can convert single image into respective cropped image so that is it for today guys in the next video we are going to detect the color using opencv so if you like this video just like this video you can use other image too so see you guys in the next video till then subscribe my youtube channel hit on the like button so you'll never miss my latest video till then goodbye